We are here today to do our part, coming together to form a Fresno Commission for Police Reform. This is a transformational time in our history, and we have the opportunity of a lifetime to address long-standing issues of racial injustice and meaningful police reform. We have a daunting challenge in front of us, and the lives of over 540,000 people will be affected. We need to develop real and sustainable solutions to make Fresno a safer place for all our residents. What we're doing today is because young people got together and said, we're tired of seeing of the racial injustice that is happening in our community. And I'm so proud um, that it is young people leading the charge. Police chiefs, mayors, and council members across this country, to include Fresno, are hearing loud and clear the need for a different style of policing, changes to the criminal justice system, and increased police accountability. And so we have a unique opportunity in Fresno and across this country to recreate policing as we know it today, to develop a new model, a new style, a new philosophy of policing in Fresno as determined by our community members and those who live in our residents. And we will be taking a comprehensive look at policing in Fresno. We will be examining uh, the philosophies of the department as it is now and measuring those philosophies along some of the best policing practices that occur in the country. There's no reason why the city of Fresno cannot have the best policing department in the country uh, and adopting the best standards of policing in the 21st century. I think it's time that we have a meaningful conversation about what we as the public or the people are willing to accept uh, as conduct that is becoming of a good police officer. Fresno can lead the way and be a shining beacon of light to serve as the model for embracing justice for all. Let's show the nation what our vision looks like.